Hello, I'm Shay Banigbe, and you should know me from Binging with Game Changers. Well, guess what? We've been binging with Game Changers for a while now. It's time to get cooking with Game Changers. <laughs> On this episode, we'll be meeting two exceptional business minds. Our corporate game changer today is Abiodun Adigo. He is the chief marketing officer at Credit Direct. And our entrepreneur game changer is Joy Odulami. She is the founder of Braiding Vault and it gets better. We will not only explore their lives at work, but they will be throwing it down in the kitchen to know who will make the best rice and beans with pepper sauce. This is going to be exciting because they'll be making delicious meals with power oil. They will be refreshed by Aquafina and their workspaces will be kept clean with Tusho. Join me, let's meet our first Game Changer. My name is Abiodun Adigun. I'll be cooking with Game Changers. I want you to watch out because I'm bringing a never seen cooking abilities and cooking skill to that kitchen. Cooking with Game Changers is proudly supported by Aquafina. My name is Abiodun Adigun. I hail from Oyo State, Ibadan precisely. Um, I schooled in Ibadan, Loyola College Ibadan, uh, for secondary school. And I went to the Polytechnic Ibadan to study the course of my dream, that's accountancy. And after that, I did switch to Caleb University to uh, obtain the, the degree program there. There I studied business admin. And also I did masters at China Europe International Business School. I'm married to my wife, Yosola, and uh, we have two children who are currently young adults pursuing their dream in universities. My morning routine starts from, I wake up early. I mean, early riser. No matter how late I sleep, I wake up early. I think latest by five, I'm up. And I'm tapping my wife. We have to pray. Uh, because why I do that? Because I want us to take that out of the way. And part of our prayer routine is that our children have to be called into the prayer time too. Hey, awesome. Hi, baby. You OK? Yeah, what's up? You're leading, you know. Mm -hmm. All right, so take us in. Let's 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 get, let's get in. What are we looking at today? I'm reading for today's efficiency for thirty-two. Okay. Effic efficiency for thirty-two. Let me get my Bible. And it reads, "Be kind of compassionate to one another, forgiving each other, just as in Christ God has forgiven you." In this sentence, Paul has summarized the biblical message that we have to be kind, compassionate, and forgiving. Call them into prayer. We do that for about 35, 45 minutes every morning. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Amen. So guys, hold on. Let Daddy close the meeting. Thank you, guys. Uh, nice talking to you guys again. And uh, don't forget the debates and send us the outline or the modality so that we can do it on time. OK, so after the morning family prayer, the next thing we do, a lot of time with my wife, we do work out together in the morning. That takes us about 45 minutes. Every day we do our workout. Is that you do it in the morning or you do it in the evening? Because where we live affords of that opportunity, you know. So don't do that. At the end of the workout, I'm back in the house, take my shower, and I'm ready for a walk. Occasionally, I do have the morning tea. I mean, that's... My wife is a lover of teas, and also different variants and brands. Those fruit teas and all that, you know, so.
am Shea Banik Bay, and I choose Power Oil because it has zero cholesterol and is great for the heart and good for my family. Cooking with Game Changers is proudly supported by Power Oil. Credit Direct, just like our name, is the foremost organization that started credit opportunity for people that were once upon a time overlooked. Credit Direct was the first organization that gave loans to civil servants. There was a time those group of people were not attractive to banks. We not only brought credit opportunities to them, we also gave it without string attached. We pioneered the non-bank lending that does not include collateral. Because of that decision to come on board, we combed the whole of Nigeria, preaching or offering this service, and also telling the government of states and by extension the federal government that you have no uh, fear in terms of when your staff access credit from us. So our loans were based on three major things, your age, your salary, and your readiness to take. To date, Credit Direct has extended facility to over three million Nigerians, both in public and private sector. We finance people to see their children through education. We finance people to finish their houses. We have the testimonials. We finance people that even at hospital situation that needed some fund and were able to come out of it. Uh, it's something we have done, not at the beginning for, 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 for profit mo motive, but for the opportunity to reach Nigerians, like I said, for the underbanked or not attractive to banking at that time. And the advantage we have, there are quite a lot of them. First, like I said, we started first. First mover advantage. Two, our biggest advertisement are stories of people, which we have loads of them. Our stories are all over Nigeria, spoken in all dialects, all languages. Three, we are an affiliate of a top bank in Nigeria. And last but not the least is our board and management. Like I said, we have a founder that is passionate about serving the people. Mr. Ladi Balogun. It's not all about profit. Then we have a team of management that are very, very interested in unearthing gems and talents, no matter how rough they are. When you bring all that together, it gives us big advantage over competition. And the last one is our spread. We're almost everywhere. When I say everywhere, there's no state of Nigeria that somebody has not taken a loan, even when we are not present there. Well, oh, come in, please. Oh, Sam, how far? My name is. How was the weekend? My name is. My name is Daniel Abimbola. I attended Covenant University and I studied computer science. So what I do at Credit Direct, basically my job title is a technical product manager. So I work with the engineering team to ensure that the business needs are met on time and properly. How far with um, some of the complaints by the guys? Yes, yeah, so some of the sales agents, they raised like, some complaints regarding they're not able to check their metrics. They're not able to check honesty care. the honesty kit. Yeah. So I took that to the team, the IT team, yeah. and we've worked on most of them. Okay. We've tested or are good to go. The kind of boss Abiodi Arigu is, is a very down to earth man, very humble, and is very free and open. Uh, but I got some feedback as early as today, like 4 a.m. this morning. Uh, do you think, um, uh, it, could they be speaking from the past experience or maybe they've, they've not tested uh, the fixes you guys have done? Also? I doubt they've tested the fixes because we just deployed like 8 a.m. Okay, this morning, okay, so okay. It's probably like something I've seen on the previous build. 
out. Okay. But we'll look into it definitely. But thanks so much. Yeah. How was the weekend? No football this weekend, right? International break. Haaland broke my heart. I wish you all the best. <laughs> all right, thanks. But thank you for the support last week. I'm looking at the appraisal scores so far. I think that sales have really embraced Seamless Hater wow. in a way that I thought was going to be a hustle. Um, I'm looking at the comparison from Q2 now with Q3 and I'm seeing improvements. My name is Ivera Nipa. I finished from Covenant University. Um, I studied industrial relations and human resource management. Um, what I do at Credit Direct, I work as a HR business partner with the people management team. Um, my core function centers around performance management and also employee engagement. You're smiling. I'm the number one of its kind, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've taken notes, and I'm sure that when we need support, as always, we'll come to you. I'm available. Piotr Adiko. We call him CMO. Um, He's very approachable. Um, I would say family-centric. You can easily walk up to him for anything. Um, I'm very keen on leaders like that, and I think that he's one leader that stands out. I've been all over, so... Hey, we have to do it again. You give I'm us ready, the yeah? support. Yeah. Thank you, boss. Thanks so much. Energy. Thank you. Energy, <laughs> energy. <laughs> Thank you, boss. All right, so I'll see you later. Thank you, boss. All right. In terms of the way we work in Credit Direct, I think we have just a flat structure in my opinion. What do I mean by that? In CDL, no matter your level, you can aspire to lead or be in charge of something. We give that opportunity, we've created that platform. And I think for me, that brings a lot of joy to the faces of people. And those are some of the high points for me in CDL. Chooks is the MD of the complaint, and um, one word I would like to describe Chooks with is, is a pragmatic human being, and he loves people. Fantastic. I think with the need for credit mm. um, at its peak in Nigeria, I think we also have that responsibility to make sure at all points in time we can serve our customers using our you know, channels. You get, I like the point you just made. I don't need people traveling so much. Let's leverage technology to the extent yeah. that we can, and let's you know make sure every Nigerian who is worthy of credit gets access to credit. I mean, that's why our team is credit direct anyway. So. Yeah, I also believe that it's coming at a very good time that Federal Government is looking at credit being one of the offerings for this current administration. And I think one of the things we should be looking at is how can we even position to be a partner to. FGN, I mean, in, in, in some way at, at some point. In terms of the work, Chooks is not patient for failure. You're either ready or you are ready. Big congratulations to um, the team. First attempt, we have it in the bag. Well done, well done to you and your guys, well done. So if, if I'm pushing you to do three times this year's number next year, honestly, you I, won't be out of place. I'm not afraid anymore. <laughs> I think we can do even four times if possible. Game Changers is proudly supported by To Shore. Morning, guys. Morning, 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 morning. How was the weekend? You guys are looking good. Thank you. Anyway, I mean, the, 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 the reason why we're here is just to quickly look at our plan for Q1 2024. And one of the things that I believe we should start with today is that I think Kola should give us a rundown of the numbers so that that guides us and guides our conversation in terms of how, in terms of setting our aspiration and the goals for 2024 and, and beyond. All right, um, looking at numbers, in terms of uh, disbursements, uh, we're close to meeting 99% of what we set out for Q3. And in terms of customer acquisition, which is part of the group, uh, um, agenda for the year, we're looking at serving the uh, 1 million customers that we promised at the beginning of the year. My name is Kola Oleshitu. I attended Federal University of Agriculture, Belkuta, um, studied uh, biology. What do I do at Credit Direct? 
I'm a sales analyst, um, data analyst, generally. Uh, Jennifer, do you have something to say around uh, customer management? What has happened? Or what is responsible for customer wanting to come back, take her loan and all that? Can you just speak to one or two things about it? Um, yes. So, um, for instance, I'll tell you that the new outlets you spoke about, almost every one of them have been engaged by the customer experience team. I mean, just imagine, the moment you get your loan, you are receiving a call to see how was this experience. Credit Ice's fastest selling product is called Sharp Sharp. It was a product that got its name from people that enjoyed the facility. I mean, in those days, when they want to describe if you want your facility or your loan sharp sharp, call Credit Direct. Well, guys, it's been such a wonderful meeting we've had. And beyond this, I feel so good. I think I'm the best guy on earth today, you know. <laughs> Having you guys, so I owe us a drink. I mean, let's just, let's just, let's just be merry, you know. I hope you don't want some. No, Yeah, dude. How far? What's up? How was the weekend? Well, good, good. Restful. Wei Ga is my colleague. Uh, both of us are in the executive management team of the organization. Wei Ga is my go-to person when I have new ideas about business. With such growth comes a lot of responsibility, so let's keep it that way. I think so far, so good. Um, but just making sure that everybody is conscious that you know, we we'll keep at it. But yeah, good, good. Uh, in the course of our working together, himself and his team, they develop what we call ERA, our Employer Risk Assessment. It helps us to fill the post of every employer or every organization we are going to. And a lot of time, that thing has proven us right. My role in Credit Direct, I'll take it from two or three perspectives. When I came in, I joined CDL as a um, business manager at Lagos. But upon joining the team, I saw the need, I saw the opportunity to take our brand to a larger place or a larger space within Nigeria. And we began to uh, make a foray into southwestern part of Nigeria more, uh, namely Ondo State, Kwara State and the likes. And the effort paid off, we got those mandates. And so within a space of working for seven months, my title was changed to Regional Ed South. West and Lagos. So I had Lagos, Ogun, Ekiti, Undo, Kwara under my watch and all that. And after some time, we had to make a strategic decision within the organization to create what we call sales division. And there were three of us who were regional heads. And we had regional head north, regional head south, west, and Lagos, and regional head south, south. And I was chosen to lead the team where all sales teams report to me. At that time, we were just in about 15, 16 states. And when we came on board, we grew up to 28 states in Nigeria and counting till tomorrow. Today, SOS have like four or five meetings back to back. And um, this also saw me meet with my team because it's a Monday, we have to meet, plan for the week, and also get feedback from the last week that might be coming from various quarters. And so all this, I mean, saw me having to wait a little while, more than I usually do, uh, in terms of my working time uh, in the office. I was supposed to go for a game of golf today, but I think I've had a very, very strong day today, and all I want is my bed at this time, you know. My expectation for the cooking competition, I'm going to bring my A game, and I'm very sure the judges will be wild by what I'm going to bring up. I look forward to it, and I'm, I promise to dazzle everybody there. Hobbies, uh, my hobbies, I, my major hobby before now, I love to play basketball. Lately, I've just joined a golf club. I've not been serious, though. My favorite Nigerian musician, Waje. I like her song, 
I like singing. Singing, singing song is very soft and easy, and you can always you can easily go with it. So I like her song. You know. Then I also like Omaomi. I just like the vibes and all that, you know. She tells a lot of story in her song and favorite Nigerian dish, jollof rice. I just like the fact that you can do it in so many ways. So would I like the CMO to pick me as cooking support? Yes, I would love to compete for him against others. I would really want to support and take front role because I know he will win. I don't think I will compliment him well as a cooking support, but anything for my boss. So the person that's coming to my mind is my business partner in the human resources department. I would like to use that point to like let them see what else I can do and um, to say thank you for the great job we have done. Hi, opponent. You should be worried. You should have sleepless nights. You should get ready. Don't bother coming. Because our credit direct, we always win. Forget our number one position. Others you can share. But this is the winner. I'm coming with a bang. See you soon. Hi, my name is Ivera Dibba. My name is Daniel Abimbola. My name is Kola Olishitsu and I work with Credit Direct. Do not stop watching. Cooking with Game Changers. I want you to watch out because I'm bringing a never seen cooking abilities and cooking skill to that kitchen. Whoever is cooking against my boss should be scared. I feel like you should be very worried because she's coming for you. And I've I tasted her cooking and I know she's very good. Her opponent should be really scared. Any words for my opponent that is coming on this show? If I was you, just cancel because I know for a fact I'm going to win. 